the Royal Yacht Gothic arrives at Port Phillip, Melbourne from Mombasa, a sad and lonely ship. She was to have borne the Princess Elizabeth, now Her Majesty the Queen, the Duke of Edinburgh and the Royal Party to Australia. The tragedy of the King's death makes it necessary for her to be stripped of her finery. Furniture the royal couple would have used is covered for storage. The Duke's room, shorn of its comfort and personality. Chief Steward Smith, in charge of complete arrangements, at the Duke's writing desk. Originally, it was on Queen Victoria's royal yacht, Victoria and Albert. The Queen's suite, now just another room. The desk and ivory telephone Her Majesty would have used. In the royal dining room are 22 vacant chairs. It would have been the scene of many cheerful dinner parties, as the then Princess and the Duke rested at sea prior to their strenuous duties ashore. The royal couple would have relaxed in this veranda cafe. The commander as Captain A.V. Richardson left with one of his officers. The Gothic, her hour of glory past, returns to the Merchant Marine. 